Hey everyone, Jessica Jablonski with the Jablonski Group. Time for another market update. Um, it's crazy to think another uh, month has gone by. So in Phoenix, we are officially in a market frenzy again. Um, our contract accepted, or our contracts that have been accepted, they're up 20%. So that is a big number. And we are certainly, um, you know, we're feeling the most frenzied, I would say in the 200 to $400,000 range. Although what I will say is that um, one of the largest comebacks has been from 500,000 to a million. Um, that number of contracts is up 167%. That is crazy. So um, to give you an idea, like in the low, like when we were really in the um, heat of the lockdown period, uh, that we were doing like 145 contracts in a week. Uh, the first week of June, we did like 395 contracts in a week. So um, it's 58% higher than this time last year even. So we can just tell the market's just really moving. And then an even more dramatic increase was a million plus. So a million plus, um, we are up 85% compared to last year, which is um, pretty hard to believe. It's amazing. So. The, uh, the result for buyers is that the inventory is, uh, you know, pre like where we were pre-pandemic, we were very, very low and we're back to that. In fact, I think we have, if you look at the start of it, we were like at 11,000 homes on the market and now we're at about 11,200. So, you know, a couple hundred more homes on the market is all that we've had. Now, during the, the real lockdown period, we did have an increase. The inventory went up like 35%, but since um, you know the restrictions have been starting to lift and all of that, uh, that inventory has just gotten sucked dry again. So, you know, we definitely have a lot of people reaching out saying, "Hey, is now like still a good time to buy?" Uh, the answer is yes, definitely. And the reason for that is uh, one huge one is the interest rates. So, the interest rates are still just um, crazy low, and that makes such a big difference. Not only you know for people who are trying to be within a certain payment range. But also just when you look at the life of the loan or at least the life of the loan that you'll pay, um, it's a pretty substantial difference. So, and we all know that we all love great interest rates. Uh, and the other piece of it is, is that affordability is still in check. So, um, you know, the, as the affordability, if that, um, you know, we were at like 67% affordability, if that number begins to drop, um, that's when we'll see that, uh, that the market start to cool a little bit. So. Uh, but, you know, right now there's a frenzy going on and um, I think that, uh, you know, you have to be ready. You have to be ready to go. You've got to be clear on what you're looking to do and it's very um, possible that you're going to be paying above lift's price. Uh, but we certainly are winning. We, um, we actually just closed on a flip property that we picked up and that property we saw it went on the market. It had been on the market four minutes when Jeffrey called. And I think the guy ended with like 15 offers after the first day and we ended up, um, you know, winning the deal and uh, it didn't necessarily have to do with paying the highest price either. It just had to do with the right timing and building the rapport with the agent and that. So you certainly can be successful in this market. Okay, on to sellers. So um, for sellers, 23% of the closings in June thus far have been over asking price. So obviously that means it's a fantastic time to sell your house. Um, we've actually heard uh, that there has been up to like 70 offers on a home, which is insane. Uh, in my opinion, the real estate agent probably should have shut it down before that. That seems a little excessive. And yet it just shows that, you know, people are out there um, really fighting for great properties. So. Um, it certainly is a time in the market where you can really like wring out the most out of your equity. Um, you know, and in terms of uh, how long will it last, you know, we're certainly feeling that pent up demand in terms of when we were, you know, as we're coming out of this pandemic or hopefully coming out of this. Uh, so, you know, that's pushing even more and causing the inventory to drop even more. Uh, but you never know how long it will last. You know, things are, big things are happening all the time that can have impacts on the market and that. And so, you know, um, I think it's a time that if you are thinking about selling, it might be, um, you know, something to consider. So as always, we are around, we love to chat. Um, we're more than happy to do a quick overview of where you're at with your properties and 
Um, you know, any information that we can provide in any more depth, we are more than happy to do so. And, you know, we always say if you guys need anything, any contractors, any referrals, um, we've got people. So we love to refer and we'd be happy to do so. So um, hope all is well with you and your families and we will talk very soon. Okay, see you later.